Hello YouTubers, Abdur Seon here from EnderTechBlackSpot.com right now. I am with Galaxy Note for AT&T. I'll be showing you how to flash official Slim Bean running Jelly Bean on your Galaxy Note. So first of all you're going to go ahead and boot into Cloud of More Recovery. So you can do this either couple of ways. So first way is to if you have extend empowerment you can press reboot and select recovery and ok if you don't have that you can go ahead and press volume up volume down and the power button first of all let go the power and at Samsung screen you can let go the other two and you will be at this screen right here and here we are going to go ahead and flash the ROM this is touch screen recovery so we all we gotta go do is double tap it wipe data factory again Double tap data five data factory reset. This will erase your old system and it will make sure that everything from old system is erased because we are doing it three times. Then wipe cache partition. Then go to advance, wipe delete cache and that's it now we're going to go ahead and press back button right here that will get you to the main menu here we are going to go to install zip from SD card now this first choice is your external second choice is your internal I have an internal I'll go there and if you don't know what external and internal I was talking about that's I was talking about your SD card now here is the slim bin ROM double tap it yes and as you can see it starts flashing their own so it says format and mount system mount data flashing boot image that's your kernel now it's done we're going to go back and flash Google Apps for Jelly Bean. And you can see the process we're going right there. It's light blue. And once you're there, go ahead and press the back button again and press power which will reboot your phone as you can see the slim bean boot animation it's very small right there that's the regular wood animation they have and slim bean rom is basically cyanogen mark 10 but really really slim it's only 75 megabytes as you can see the soft flick light is up that means we are not going to boot looping as I always say in my how to videos and this is jelly bean so you're, if you're flashing from ICS it will take time so give it a time I recommend when you're flashing let, let the phone sit for five minutes come back and then start using so this new system gets settled down
and there you go this phone has booted up now and that's the very screen you're gonna end up when your phone finishes booting as always guys if you think my videos are helpful like button is right there subscribe button is up there and I'll see you in the next video thank you